You guys know what time it is. Welcome back to Fantasy Fire Hours here on MLB The Show 23. Today we have some new additions or new kind of like changes we made to the squad. First of all, Anthony Rizzo is someone I picked up last or either last week or two weeks ago because I didn't have a first. I didn't, Paul Goldschmidt was my only second baseman. And when Paul Goldschmidt, I think he was either injured or he just like they didn't play for a while. I needed a new first baseman. Anthony Rizzo is on the free agent market. I went and picked him up. So he is one of the new additions. Also someone else we are trying. Technically not a new addition, just a new card. Um, but Nolan Arenado, his card is supercharged at the time of this recording for the next six minutes. So if we get into a game and we get someone to quit, we are probably not going to be able to do Paul Goldschmidt's, or sorry, Nolan Arenado's supercharged card. I'm going to try to keep this intro short so that by the time I get in the game, his thing isn't gone. But then also Wilson Contreras last week got a Topps Now card. So we finally have a Diamond Wilson Contreras in the game. Not a bad card. 100 plus power against lefties. Decent against, you know, righties and lefties in terms of power and contact. On lower difficulties, this card's going to be fine. On higher difficulties, we may have a bit more of a challenge. Uh, Brandon Lau is on the bench because I picked up a second baseman due to Jazz being hurt. And that hurts my soul. However, uh, I'm going to keep him for a second game because I want to have him when I debut another card. So we're still going to keep Jazz in. Other than that, oh, and also on, on the pitching side... Logan Webb got a Team Affinity 2 card. So instead of his live series, we now have a Diamond Logan Webb card that we can use. Oh my god, why am I burping? Another person who got a Set 2 or a Team Affinity 2 card is closing pitcher David Bednar. So we have a Diamond pitcher there. And then now this Kenley Jansen. I know I just made a video on him not too long ago. But Kenley Jansen got a 99 card for being a new member of the 400 Save Club. Has a lot better pitch mix than the one that we use, plus 125 hits per nine and pitching clutch. Quirks, he's a better night player and home player. We play at home at night anyway, so that's going to be something. Let's go hop in a game before Nolan Arenado no longer is supercharged. And let's see if we can get a dub today. If you guys are wondering, this is not coffee. This is just straight up milk. If you guys didn't see the last episode of Fantasy Fireballers where Masataka Yoshida made his debut, you need to go watch that. Masataki Yoshida at least hit off the wall. Hit off the wall. What is this guy doing? Bro, is I know he's only a 90 overall, but is this Masataki Yoshida card like gloat like goaded? Oh, it gets past the catcher. Masataka is gonna advance to third. Let's go. Ooh, almost back at the pitcher. Anthony Rizzo in his first at bat on the fantasy fireball squad. Gets an RBI single. We are up one nothing. Full count on Aaron Judge. Jazz Chisholm on the deck. On the deck. Why? Why do I speak? Every video. It is every video. I kid you not. Every single video I do, I stumble over my words to the point where it's oh, it's it's shocking. I made it through elementary school. Ah, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Oh come on, get through. God damn it. Wow. All right, I mean, good play at short, but I thought I finally made good contact with that. We only get the one run. Let's see how no one... No one went. I... Just stop talking. Stop talking. You fucked up again. It's fine. Hold, hold the fuck up. Hold the fuck up. Did they just say on commentary that Logan Webb is legally blind? Because of an astigmatism? Am I hearing that correctly? So you're out here telling me that if this dude, like, <laughs> how can he see? Dude, back to back strikeouts. Logan, he didn't swing the bat at all that at bat, so I'm wondering if he just, like, set the controller down, maybe? I am concerned. I. I don't know what's happening. No, he's swinging the bat. Oh, that went foul. Wow. Dude, a 3K in it. Logan Webb is off to a good start. Dude. How? How did I miss it by that much? Wilson Contreras still bad and low in the lineup. But looking to get his first hit with his diamond car. Oh, yes, sir. Perfect, perfect grounder through the middle. Or through in between short and third. Why do you guys watch my videos? It's definitely not for the commentary. Dude, is there any way Masataka Yoshida can get out when he's, like, hitting? 
Because I'm pretty sure he's only gotten out once in the two games I've used him so far. Oh, Gonna try an inside up. sinker oh, here. Didn't go for the off-speed low changeup. We got him. Four Ks through four batters. You'd love to see it. We got him. Just... All right, that ends the strikeout streak, but two, one, two, three innings. Is that the, is that, that's the phrasing, right? Yes. No? Mookie, Mookie. Fuck, that takes away the perfect game and no hitter all in one. They kind of did Mookie dirty with his speed. Because I feel like Mookie, I don't know. Maybe I'm just salty because I wanted him to make that play. I don't know. Got him with the sinker. Six Ks on the day. Despite not having the perfect game or no hitter anymore, I am so okay with six Ks. Fastball's only hitting 93, so I'm not going to be able to get it past him again. Low change up. There you go. Made it through three. We finally give up a hit, but it's whatever. Oh, yes, against it. Opposite field hit. We're going to try for two. Should be good. Lead off single. Lead off double. Lead off, extra base hit for Lindor. Shit. He hung the damn splitter, and I got underneath it. Also, 16 frames per second, I just saw. My 13. We are down to third goddamn team. What in the fuck? Couldn't locate it. He walks Ozzy Albies, Anthony Rizzo coming up to the plate. Multiple runners on. No, you're not about to tell me I just grounded into a double play. I actually suck today. Six hits, only one run. Brings in a new hitter, and it's still a righty. He brings in Mark McGuire. Which Mark McGuire is? This is 90. You had this motherfucker on the bench? Are you dumb? I'm going to get really weird right now, and there's a slight chance that this comes back to bite me in the ass. He wasn't seeing it coming. Double digit Ks for Logan Webb. Dude, who did, you just brought in Brooks Robinson. Why did you have all these guys on the bench? Don't tell me he's about to bring in Sammy Sosa or some dumb shit. Who does he have in the bullpen? Oh, roll this Chapman and Josh Hader. I am actually fucked. I gotta put up some more insurance runs because I have a feeling this guy is gonna start hitting soon if he's bringing in 99s off the bench. Fuck. Tactical nuke incoming! You're kidding me. The first pitch I ever see of Chapman and it's an Aaron Judge home run? Nah. I don't care that it was less than 100 miles per hour and less than 400 feet. We're watching the replay on that. Fuck you. That's right. I'm a prick. I'll admit it. I'm probably... I don't mind if I get beamed this next pitch. I deserve it. Get through. Damn it, man. 98 miles per hour, too. I swing at ball four again. I'm an idiot. Wilson, yes sir, that's another base hit for Wilson Contreras. He is two for three on the day. Don't, another. Oh, he's gonna outrun it. He's gonna say another double play. I would have, I would have done so many things. Off the end of the bat though, I was, fuck. Dog, why do you have 499s Two of which are collection rewards on your goddamn bench. Foul tip. Let's go. 12 Ks for Logan Webb. Goddamn. Swing and miss. Lucky 13 Ks on the day. I don't know. Do I give him more innings? Or do I get some more pitchers in here? Because I do want to use some of those other pitchers. Dude, I'm pretty sure he auto-pitched, and I still hit into a double play. All right, I have made the executive decision. I am going to cut Logan Webb's day there. He had an amazing day, only had a one-hit game going, 13 Ks. But I want to showcase some of these new arms. Wow, he really did not see that. Um, Let's try it again, but up. Dog, David Bednar 
Getting his first K with his dime. All right, now I want to go splitter, but I also feel like he's going to swing at the 12 6 regardless. And he did. And that is going to be a great showcase from David Bednar. That's going to be his only inning because next inning we're going to use 99 Kenley Jansen to close it out. Or put it in the outfield, one of the two. Base hit for Nolan Arenado, supercharged card, finally. And he walked it. Walks Mookie Betts. Wilson Contreras, a guy who kills lefties, is up to bat. Oh, it probably... Oh, no, it doesn't have the distance. Damn, man. Just off the end of the bat. 91 mile per hour exit VLO. Frankie Lindor. Francisco Lindor, 99 card. Three run moonshot. 102 off the bat. Finally, 100 plus mile per hour exit VLO stayed fair. We're going to take out David Bednar and use 99 Kenley to save, or I guess maybe not save the game, but close out the game. Dog, you suck. Don't throw at me and then proceed to suck ass. Quick out number two. Ground out to Anthony Rizzo. One more out to win the game. Oh, come on. Wow. All right. Two hits on the day. One from Kenley. One from Logan Webb. Still no runs. Oh, my God. That should have been the strikeout pitch, but I decided to be stupid and do it. Two strikes. Swing and miss. Third out of the inning. Last out of the game. We win 5-0. Our offense went a little quiet for most of the game until Francisco Lindor blew it wide open. 13 Ks of one-hit baseball. Seven innings from Logan Webb. Amazing day. Our hitters towards the end did pretty good, too. I'd say today was a success.